Hi everyone. Hello and welcome to Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree Haul. I am here. We are back together and I am always so grateful, thankful, and blessed to be here with every single one of you. I hope you all have had the most amazing couple of days since I saw you last on Happy Monday Dollar Tree Haul. Can't wait to get into this, share and show you the things that I found over the last few. Every single item in this haul is $125 a piece except for this first item. It is $150 and I will show it to you now. So let's dive in. I got these beautiful sunglasses and I love the purple tint to them plus the frames are a light lavender matte look and I think that they're absolutely beautiful all of their sunglasses eyeglasses readers they're all a dollar fifty a piece and I still think that that is a pretty good deal this says ultraviolet protection and I think those are just beautiful so I had a pair like that when I was a teenager and I loved them the most so I was very excited to see those now let's get into the 125 items I found these bouquet bags they have a nice strong sturdy structure there were four of them to choose from but I picked out three that I really liked I love the color combination all the beautiful beautiful springtime looking flowers on them the ribbon I just love them and they're a really decent size they puff out you can get a nice big bouquet for Mother's Day for an anniversary a birthday for just a Friday night after the weekends whatever makes you happy so there's that design then we also have this really beautiful gorgeous springtime design on this one too and the gorgeous ribbon right up at the top and then this one is a little bit tamer and maybe you can get a nice um, neutrally looking rose to put into this and I love the uh, design of it I just think that they did a wonderful job the one that I did leave behind was like a light pink and it had swirly twirlies through it but it wasn't as jazzy as I would like it to be so I didn't pick that one up and I love the ribbon choice for this one as well. So I thought that those were really nifty, cool, and cute. So I scooped them right up. Now, okie dokie then. Let's talk about comfort for Mother's Day, for any day. I love these slippers. So this is 95 nine and a half to ten and a half shoe size so this size is an XL but they did have it in all the sizes um, from small to XL and these fuzzy slippers here this says live life in full bloom and that is pretty cool to go with a nice bouquet of flowers it does have this side right here um it's not grippy this is a slippery surface especially if you have like hardwood floors linoleum or something like that so maybe you'd need to put some grippy pads on that if you would be afraid of slipping or if you just use those for bathroom shower slippers they're nice and cozy though they're super duper soft so i got all three pairs that i found this one says chaos coordinator so I love that and I did get this in a different size um this is large and it's an eight to nine shoe size these are all juncture by the way and this one is for me I bought that one for myself I loved it and then we have this blue one right here and the saying on this is enjoy the little things so like I said, they just feel so cozy and I don't wear shoes in my house. Like you guys have heard me say probably a billion times. This is an XL too, by the way. Um, and we wear socks and slippers in here and that's it. So I thought that that was pretty nifty, cool and cute for sure. I found these beautiful dangling frames. I couldn't believe it when I found them in the uh, lineup of all the Mother's Day stuff. This has a chain right here and a loop up top so that you can hang it. And that would be so beautiful, absolutely so beautiful to dangle. A beautiful picture inside of this. So it does take a four by four photo frame from Special Moments. And this is the gold look to this beautiful shape. So I picked this one up. I found two. So I picked up the two that I found. And then I found this circular one that is black. And then we have the chain with the loop right up at the top. So I just think that these are so nifty, cool, and cute, and jazzy. So this will slip right out, and then you can cut down a 4x6 to size it to a 4x4 and slip it in there for the picture. 
I just think that that is definitely awesome. Definitely awesome. And I use frames all the time because I love photographs in my house. I did find this frame also and I'm loving that gorgeous border around it. That frame with that wood green look and just the color of the wood is really pretty. There's the hanging mechanism on the back but you also have a stand option as well. And this is a nice big frame. It's a um, 8 by 10 8 by 10 for a special moment. So if you take a nice family portrait, I thought Cindy did the coolest thing. My son's girlfriend, Cindy, for Christmas, she took professional photographs of herself and her siblings for her parents for their Christmas gift of just her and her siblings. And she framed a bunch of pictures for them. So if you wanted to do something like that to surprise your parents for Mother's and Father's Day and have it framed in a beautiful frame, that is definitely a nice choice for that. We also have this really gorgeous, and this is a mirror. This is not a frame. It is a beautiful mirror. And I love the shape of it. Absolutely love it. You can hang it up if you choose to, but I think I'm going to situate it on a counter space and make like a vanity spot for myself. And that's a decent size mirror. So it doesn't say an exact measurement, but hey girl, hey, I see you in that camera over there. Um, I, I do see this being able to, you know, do my makeup in or anything else. And I liked the black look to it. It didn't have any other color choices, or I probably would have gotten a white or a tan or something like that. But the black is perfectly fine because I'm going to bedazzle that with flowers and I'm going to hot glue flowers all around it. So that's what I'm going to do with that. And I thought that that was pretty spiffy. Now, now look at these. These are beautiful and they're very big. They're very big. They're porcelain, so they're definitely breakable. But will you look at the beautiful designs on it? Absolutely stunning. They did an amazing job picking out these designs for this. So this is, it just says decor. I'm not going to take it apart because these are being gifted away. So I'm going to keep the wrap on it, but you take that lid off and then inside, it's a big old space. I am going to take it apart because I want you to see it. I want you to see it. I just don't, I just really hope I don't break it. So that is a nice space to be able to use it for jewelry or whatever you would like to put in there. What a gorgeous little um, thing for a 125 to put in a gift set. And then that wonderful, beautiful design. And I do love the blue and the off-white coloring to both of them. So picked those up for certain. Yes, I did. And now this is a big old mirror. This is humongous. Hey, you can see all my blankets. <laughs> um, So this is a big old mirror. And I am turning it sideways because I don't know what you're going to see over there. And I don't want you to see anything funny or weird because <laughs> I can't really look past the camera right now to check out the ambiance. But anyways, this is a nice mirror and it's a decent size too. It's a beautiful, gorgeous size. And this is all mirror all the way around. Um, you can definitely hang it up, have it upside down for you, but right there you can put a pin in the wall and hang it. And that is going to be quite lovely. Well, look at that. There is my TV over there. I don't know where to turn this thing. So anyways, it's nice and large, or you could use it as a tray and you could put things on it to hold, you know, even those porcelain little jewelry boxes. I think that that would be beautiful as well. So I picked those up and I thought it was all absolutely amazing. Now I do want to show you this other glass stuff really quick before it goes down for the count. These have to be the most beautiful, beautiful candle holders that I've ever seen them have. Um, this right here just says candle holder. It doesn't say anything else to it. So you buy beautiful, beautiful pillar candles, small ones, and put them in here. You can set them on that mirror. And if you use it as a tray, and that would be completely beautiful and lovely. The color of that one was my favorite. This one is an absolutely beautiful shade as well. And the designs of them is just pretty as pretty can be. So, and here is this really nice one that's a little bit iridescent. So when you move it around, you can see some color sprinkling around it. So that's pretty exceptional and fun. And I hope you loved it just as much as I did. Now, let me get the rest of this class out of here. Like I told you, 
these are really beautiful too and these are porcelain as well this says always grateful so i loved these for myself i love to put things up that have inspirational sayings or blessings to them i love to read it all throughout my house this is just a beautiful decoration piece it's a nice thick quality so it will be able to stand up on its own and i have to say i'm pretty excited about the design on it we have this one right here that says stay um stay inspired that's what this one says and I like the colors to this one also. Now I've just started putting up all of my decorations for springtime. So I'm going to mingle these in with that. And the colors will go nicely with what I have for it. So that is exciting stuff. And so many choices that you can put together for whatever special woman is in your life that was a parental figure to you. So I thought it was just absolutely perfection. Now this right here, this is a candle holder. And I love the way that they did these. This is a beautiful gold finish on it, but it, they made it look like leaves or it could even be um, like sea life, you know, in the ocean, those beautiful wavy little arms that are on here. You put a candle right up at the top, a pillar candle, or you could make this into a flower is what I was thinking. If you put a beautiful faux flower in it and these look like the petals. So I thought that that was uh, the leaves actually. So I thought that this was really nice and I can see it in any part of my house, even in my bathroom on the sink with a nice flower in it. So I thought that was pretty cool. Now, okay, I, I thought that this was pretty grand too, to have these choices for anybody that likes to do their nails at home. I mean, this is like going to the nail salon. So this is from B Color. This is Artificial Nail Tips. There's 80 pieces in here. And they're extra long, but you can definitely cut them down to size so that you can have them the length that you choose. The glue is not included, it says, so you would have to um, buy glue separately. And they do have Ioni glue that works really well that I've picked up multiple times to put nails on for myself. So I thought that was jazzy. And then to cut down the nails, I found this right here from Sassy and Chic. And this is a nail clipper. And this almost looks like what they use to cut down longer nails when you're at a nail salon. So you just put the nail right inside of there and chomp it off. And I picked up this color for the device, um, but they had a couple of other choices for that. So I thought that that was just a great um, little pair for that one. And then right here from Sassy and Chic, Chic, this is a gel polish remover tool. I've never seen that. And the gel nail polish is just a little bit more difficult to come off. So to have a tool for it, just so that you can scrape it gently off of your nail, to make sure it all gets off is very handy dandy. So I, I grabbed that to go with that set as well to gift away for Mother's Day. So I love it. I love it so much and I hope you guys love it too. Now, last but not least, I forgot the mug over here, but with those beautiful slippers, if you give them a nice coffee mug that says this beautiful saying on it, that is a relaxing day at home for mom. Home is where mom is. And I love it, especially with the wreath design around it. So I thought that this was so nice. I'm actually keeping this mug for myself because I just loved it so much. I thought it was really extra pretty. And with my gray slippers, I'm going to have myself a happy, relaxing day. So I picked up that mug to add it to my mug collection that is bigger than my whole house. <laughs> <laughs> so there is that and I love it now okay I found these beautiful clips I think that they're really nice because they can just grab little sections of hair so this is claw clips and there are eight pieces in here I love the colors and the tones to it and how glossy they are so I scooped those up and they're just like you know they chomp on your hair and they don't cut it off, but they just clip it in the right spot. And then this one is a little bit different of a shape. So this is more of like a moon type of shape, the clip. And there are eight of them in this set as well. So I thought that those were really great because it's nice to just kind of grab the sides and bring them up and secure them. And then you can wear your hair like half up and half down. I found some great elastics and I definitely needed some elastics because I'm just running out, misplacing them and all that. So there's 20 pieces in here and I do so love 
the gorgeous colors that they chose for this plus those that have a little bit of like texture to them and like braiding type of look and all the different colors mingled between them so I grabbed that set and that set made me really extra happy too okay now look at this Look at this. I got two packs of these for the guys. And this is Winchester Protective Gear. And it says High Visibility Grip 3-Pack. It's a large size. It's coated for cleaning, automotive, general maintenance. And I love that there's three sets in there. So this goes for roughly about $11 at Home Depot. My honey bunny, he looked it up and he was like, wow. That's a good deal. So I was really happy to grab these for both guys and they will come in great use. So picked those up right away when I saw those great things. And those were in the tool bench section in a box of their own. And then I found this. I actually hauled, this is different than the one I hauled for you guys a couple of weeks ago. This is the Sure Fresh Air Fryer Parchment Paper. But this one is a smaller size than the one that I showed you with 15 liners in it. This one has 20 liners. So this is just a little bit smaller for you to fit in the air fryer. And like I said, we have an air fryer. We use it all the time. And these just come in great use because you can just cook on them and then crumple them up and toss them away. So I picked up the second set that had even more in it, just a little bit smaller and not even that much smaller, to be honest with you. Those are pretty decently sized as well. I found these two cleaners. Uh, they're not cleaners. They're spray refills. They're not. It does say Lysol on it. That's why I got confused. For use in Glade, Lysol, and Airwick uh, dispensers. So this is the Surefresh brand. And this is Hawaiian Automatic Spray Refill. 4.5 ounces. And that just looks really, really nice. And I spritzed it and it smells great. So I thought that that was pretty grand for a refill. And then this one I grabbed. This one was next to it and it's Berry Blast in the 4.5 ounces. So picked both of those up for a little bit of summery jazziness in my house in the sense. Now, where are we off to? Where are we off to? Because there's just so many things in so many different directions. After I spritz my house, a nice, nice scent. I found this beautiful sign to hang up so that it looks like the beach in here. This says home. And I think that they did an amazing job with that beautiful wheel in the middle with the flowers sprayed all around it as the O. So it's just a simple sign and it's going to go really well on one of my doors. Um, even something that is in the living room on the wall. Once I start to put up my summer decorations, and then it has the rope on both sides to border it. So I thought that that was extra, extra beautiful. And I was happy to find a beautiful sign that looked like that. And that was just in the regular sign section. That wasn't in the, um, that wasn't with all of the nautical stuff and the ocean themed beach things that are coming out. That was kind of just floating by itself with some signs that said porch and home sweet home. And I plucked it right up from there and I thought it was just as beautiful as all of the other stuff that I've been finding in the beach selection. Now, look at these. These are a lot of fun. These are beautifully, beautifully done. And this is a placemat. This is a placemat, and it's really large. It's 13 inches by 17 inches, and it's that beautiful gold. It's so shiny and gorgeous, and it's a nice, heavy quality. So whether you want to decorate with that on your table for a summertime, or even if you just like that gold look, I think that that's really attractive. And then here is another one. And this one is just a little bit smaller and it's a beautiful, beautiful green color with, it's just nice and glossy like the gold one was. This one is 12, 12 and a half inches by 15 inches. So what I was thinking of doing probably for, you know, um, just a little beach tropical theme decorating in the summertime is overlapping them in the center of my table out on the patio because these would work really well for outside. So, and then just putting like a little centerpiece arrangement on them. So 
I really liked those. I thought they were extra beautiful and pretty. And then I found these signs I did. I had to get them now. You know when things come out, I know it's a little bit early, but we're already in April. Before we know it, we'll be at the end of May. And then it will be really like gearing up into like summer type of weather around here where I live in Massachusetts and New England. And this stuff was out now and I had to pick it up. I did. This is a beautiful sign with these gorgeous beads. I think that they did a stellar job this year with what I've seen come out for the beach themed um, decorations. This says high tides, good vibes. And that is really pretty. Look at all that sparkle. And then the little chair, the beach chair and the umbrella is matte to the board, but the beach chair is an addition piece onto the board. And I just love the shape of it. The color of the beads is exceptionally beautiful. And that's the line that it came out in. So we have that one. We have this one, which happens to be my favorite of the three that I got. So it says, hello, summer. And I love my pineapple signs. I have many of them in my decorations that I already own. And I love the colors of the lettering they did in summer. So all the glitz and glam and the beautiful beads that go along with this one. So I picked this up and that is going to be super duper pretty to hang up for the summer months. And then this is the third one. This is the beautiful third one. Look at all the pretty beads all around it. And then this one says fun in the sun. And that beautiful popsicle right there is an addition piece onto the board as well. Now that pineapple topper was the addition piece onto this board. So it kind of just jets out a little bit, but I just love it. I think that they are super duper extra cool and cute and I had to pick them up. Now, we do have some more bead-like finds over here. So I picked them all up because I know that they're not gonna be there for too long. This is the same line. This is wooden beaded garland. And here we are. They're nice, long, big, gorgeous, beautiful. And this one has a pineapple on it. Beautiful pineapple. We have the tassel with the little ribbon right here. And that is so pretty. So, so beautiful and pretty. I'm so excited for these. We also have the watermelon one. Look at how pretty the watermelon one is. I think the watermelon one is certainly, certainly my favorite for certain. You think I could say certain one more time? I couldn't think of any other word to say. So, <laughs> and then we have the flamingo. We have the flamingo, which is definitely almost right at the top of my list as well. The flamingo is beautiful, absolutely well done. I think she's just as precious as precious could be. And I love the colors of the beautiful beads that they chose for this particular one. And now, lastly, we have the lemon. We have the beautiful, gorgeous lemon right here and all those pretty ones dangling around it, those beautiful beads, the little tassel with the gorgeous little ribbon down there. And I just think that they did a stellar job with what they have been coming out with this year. So pick those up. Now I found this sign and there were other ones that were like this, but I loved the Aloha with the beautiful flamingo right there. So, and we have a little bit of beading right up at the top that you can move around and I just think that it's simple and nice. I love the wood frame around it and that's going to be really pretty, especially these things to put outside for like a little luau moment or something during the summer. We love luau's. I love a good 80s themed party where we all dress up in 80s colors and it's all neon and vibrant and Hawaiian themed with grass skirts and lays and everything else and it's just it's just so much fun I love the summer it just makes me happy so this is a door banner and this is what it looks like all taken apart and unfolded and these are very large they're really nice big and long and this is a 59 inch by 11 inch banner so that's great I'm gonna take it out I'm gonna I'm gonna open it I'm going to open it. I'm not going to open all of them because I have some others over here too, but I'm going to just show you a little bit of it. So here is the bottom and wow, it's so pretty. Oh, it's absolutely lovely. It's just, it's just adorable. And there it, 
the string is to be able to hang that up. So I got that for the outside of my door after I start to decorate my porch and everything like that. Now, let them see, let them see where we're going because we still have some things. Jingle all the way, my little, my little muffins. Oh, we're in a tangle. We're in a tangle here. So this is a necklace. It's 30 inches and there's three of them in each one. And I've never seen them do this as a design ever. How beautiful with the little flowers all on the beads to add to a really special fun night. So I had the pink one as well as the blue. Three in that set too. Three in all of these sets so that I don't have to keep saying it. Come on. I do love the sound of that. Uh, and then this really nice, beautiful yellow for these. And then lastly, we have the beautiful, gorgeous, vibrant green ones. So that's exciting stuff. And I was so excited to be able to get those and have those in my stash for summer vibes. Alrighty then. These are gonna be used for so many different purposes and I'm excited to get them into my um, bag so that I can bring them to the beach. These are drink pouches and there are six of them in each package. That is a lot. So if you were gonna use these as drink pouches, that would cover a whole nice party. I would think, you know, several packages of these, six in each for $1.25. That's the design on this one. But I'm thinking I could put, you know, like a ribbon or something through that to carry it around my neck, go to the ocean front, walk on the beach, find seashells and sand dollars and use this as a pouch for that. You could use these for whatever purpose you would choose. They're just plastic. They come with all of these great straws inside of the package so that if you did use them for a drink, um, you can just put the little the little straw right through and sip out of this great thing. And they're nice. You wash them by hand. I've used these in, in the past, but they were definitely different and they had less in the packages back then when these first showed up. So here is this design right here. This one is extra vibrant fun. That would also be really good for my 80s themed party. This just has all kinds of different summer vibes on it. And there are the straws right inside, six of them in there. And then this one right here. I mean, you could even use these for organization reasons, for stickers, you could use them to do whatever you want to with them to hold organized paperwork, what not receipts if you have to keep receipts throughout the year. There's just so many to go around for so many different reasons. This one says sweet summer with the palm tree there. And I just love it. You could even put the ribbon around it, carry it around your neck, put your personal items in, inside of it and just have it on you if you're going to a concert or a venue where you just want your things on you personally and right up front, put your phone in there, you know, whatever you need. So those are gonna be multi-purpose for me and I'm gonna use them for all kinds of stuff. Now, my Lanta, my Lanta, I love them. I'm absolutely, absolutely obsessed and in love with these. I found these uh, yesterday morning. This is a popsicle canteen and the shape of it, there were four colors, but I only picked up the two that I wanted. They're plastic hand wash and they are just adorably cute. Here's the little spout right here. You take that little rubbery uh, cover off. It has an adjustable strap so that you can use it as a crossbody. This is perfection and the straw goes right down inside so that you can have a nice beverage inside of there. So there is the blue one and then here is the really beautiful gorgeous pink one. These are just fun. This is a fun time. You could even get those as um like party favors if you were going to have like a small type of like Hawaiian themed party on a summer night and use those for gifts for people to go away with. I would take those. I think that they're really cute. I think that they're adorably fantastic. Now look at this cup. This is a fun old cup right here. This says sweet summer and look at those strawberries. 
Those are beautiful, vibrant strawberries. I love the tint to the cup. It's so tall and large. Does it say, it says it's a tumbler, but I would just call this a cup. It doesn't say how many fluid ounces, but you can fit a lot of ice and a beverage in there. The straw spout goes right into the cup and then you sip and it swirls and twirls right into your, right into your mouth right through the straw. So that is extra cute. And I definitely would wash that by hand as well. I wash my, my dishes by hand anyways. I feel personally safer that way because I know how I wash my dishes. So that's just what I'm used to anyways. But if you had a dishwasher, I would still wash that by hand because you don't want to put that in the dishwasher and then have it destroyed or something like that because it doesn't give specific instructions on how to clean it so there is that beautiful cup now these i thought that these were so darling this is um a static cling tile sticker color appearing so you'd put these in the bathroom the shower you know for the kids to play on and just look at and then that beautiful image is just fun to engage in I just think that this is really nifty, cool, and cute for a little ambiance in the tub for the kiddos. So I picked that one. Then I got this one that is a mermaid ocean theme. And that one is super duper extra special. So I picked both of those up, but there were a couple of other choices as well. Those were my fave though. Those definitely were my favorite. Okay, before we get too far off of the wonderful things that I have found for the summertime. They, they have tons and tons of 4th of July stuff out, Patriots Day, Independence Day, all the beautiful things. And these cups were extra fabulous too. So I did pick these up. They do just say on the bottom, hand wash only. These are very specific. Straw with tumbler. They have adjustable straps. These straps are more of like a ribbon type of material than the other ones were. Uh, like a ribbed type of material is what I'm saying. I apologize. And then the straw goes right inside. And then there are the caps right on the top to be able to take off and sip out of. And you can remove them to wash them. So going to see the fireworks, going to a carnival for the 4th of July. Those would be really nice to cross body and have some beverages inside of too. So I picked those up. And then here, here right here we have some door banners. And I'm going to put these on both sides of my door on my front porch. This is a 59 inch by 11 inch. And this is what it looks like. It says freedom. It's beautiful. It has some fireworks right down at the bottom. And it is the same exact size as the one that I did take out for you. So I picked that up and I loved it extra much. And I really, really adore just the American flag right here. So I can't wait to do that. I usually uh, decorate for the 4th of July in the end of June and then keep, the, keep it up pretty much for the rest of the summer. So I loved that. Now we do have some wonderful beads that you could keep up all the time anyways. I think that these are beautiful. And I did pick out the one that has the heart with the American flag look to it. So that one was my favorite. They did have some other choices as well. We have the tassel down here with the ribbon and they're a great size just like the other one was. So I picked those and those made me happy too. So loved it. Okay, we're dwindling down and I will do it fast for you. We have these cute graduation owls. I could not even believe my eyes Cindy's little brother is graduating, so I will offer them to her. And if not, I will keep them in my stash for future references. And when I could potentially and possibly ever need these cutie patooties. So we have this one right here with his glasses on. And the diploma, he's so absolutely beautiful and precious. So I scooped him right up. And then I have this one on with his glasses and his bow tie. And he's holding a grad little um, decoration piece in his beautiful little wing. I love the tassels just dangling down on their, 
on the side of them. They're just absolutely precious and beautiful and they made me really happy and I couldn't leave them behind. So I have to find the purpose for them to put them up somewhere special. <laughs> so, so there is that too. Now, lastly here, we have this book and it's absolutely precious. Um, this is The Power of Heart when and how to get out of your brain. And this is another self-help book that I love. Praise for the power of heart. Every day we make important choices and vital decisions, relying on our overtired, distracted brains. Um, and it's an inspiring, wise book is the gift of grace. We all need to remind us that our true source of wisdom, wisdom is only a heartbeat away. This book originally went for $28.99 and I cannot wait to read it. It's a hardcover book and it's absolutely important. And I love self-help books or anything that can make me dive into myself. So is that it? That is it. I love you guys. Happy, happy Wednesday Dollar Tree haul. I love all your beautiful faces. I'm Callan. I would love it if you'd stick around, stay, like, share, subscribe, comment down below, hit the bell notification so that you are aware of every single time that I upload a new video. Here on this channel, I do Dollar Tree hauls on Saturdays, Mondays, and Wednesdays. I'm super grateful for you guys spending any amount of time with me. So I will be seeing you again on happy Saturday. And I thank you for spending your moments with me today. Love you guys so much. See you soon. Bye everyone.